Amy Robach has their remarkable story. Amy, good morning. And good morning to you. Doctors told Kate and David Ogg of Sydney, Australia, their baby boy was dead. But what happened was next was nothing short of a medical miracle. The birth of a baby, one of life's happiest moments. But for Kate and David Ogg, their elation came to a screeching halt after one of their twins, baby Jamie, born premature at 27 weeks, was pronounced clinically dead. Doctors told her, I said, Jamie didn't make it, we've lost him. The nurse handed the baby's limp body to his parents to say goodbye. But instead, the mother talked to her newborn when she could have been mourning him. This footage taken by her midwife. Jamie lay on his mother, skin to skin, for two hours. She cuddled him and stroked him and said, your twin sister Emily is fine. He started gasping more and more regularly. I'm like, oh my God, what's going on? She says the doctors told her not to get her hopes up. It's just a reflex. He can't be alive. Then um, a short time later, he opened his eyes. Kate put breast milk on her finger, held it at Jamie's lips, and he started sucking. Her doctors were in shock. He just kept shaking his head and moving it around. I don't believe it. I don't believe it. A medical miracle. Baby Jamie came back to life before their eyes. Luckily, I've got a very smart, very strong wife who um, instinctively did what she did. If she hadn't have done that, I believe that Jamie probably wouldn't be here. It's inspiring. 